Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Kehlani. Um, as you can see from the title, I'm going to be doing like a DIY trim your own hair at home type deal today. Um, I am trying a new technique today. I haven't trimmed my hair like this before. That's just because uh, my hair has changed a lot over the past year or so. Um, the last time I really did a really good trim on my hair was um, when I dyed my hair blonde and I used to always trim my hair on my own and always shaped my hair on my own so um, I'm gonna just adjust to you know how my hair is now it's it's changed a lot it's blonde now it isn't as healthy as it used to be um, so my hair is basically um, just combed out from an old braid out I'm going to split my hair into different sections so that I can just cut little by little and um, I am gonna cut like very little at first that's just always how I start and then um, if I want to go back and do more I'll go back and do more So now I'm just re-detangling my hair. Um, again, this is just an old braid out that I have going on here. Um, so my hair is just a little bit stretched out. I am going to put my fingers to where I want to cut. And um, if you can see like the ends are a little straggly, I'm going to put my fingers at like a diagonal shape so I can get like that heart shape. And I'm just cutting a little bit off just to kind of see where I want it to be, just getting those like straggly, ugly ends off. Um, yeah. So I'm just kind of cleaning it up now. Even after that little cut, it already like feels a lot better. Um, I ended up going back after doing all sections. I ended up going back and cutting off just a little bit more just because, you know, it's going to grow back. So I just felt like, you know, why trim just a little? I'm going to just go ahead and get rid of all the dead ends. Also, please don't mind my big old eyeballs. I'm really focused. My husband was helping me um, film this and I can't believe he didn't say a thing about my gigundo eyeballs um, i'm just really focused guys <laughs> so after i've done each side i kind of just stretch it out a little bit just to see if it's even um, and if not just go back and even it out as you can see i kind of have that diagonal shape which is what i was going for So for this top half, I'm just going to go ahead and split it in two. I kind of have like a box shaped head, so I'm going to go ahead and split it like right at that corner. And um, I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing. Um, put my fingers to where I want it to be cut at. As you can see, my ends are pretty bad. Like they're really thin. So that's, you know, where you see it to start thinning. That's where you want to cut. Um, obviously, you don't have to, but um, personally, I just... I just want to cut the whole thing off just because, you know, your hair grows faster when you're trimming regularly. I have no excuse of why I've been skipping out on trims. Um, but yeah, your hair growth will change dramatically if you are trimming regularly. Uh, for me, because my hair isn't as healthy as I would like it to be. So I would say every three to four months or just when needed. If your hair is a little bit healthier, I feel like you don't need it as much. I'd say like every six months ish.
Okay, so now that I've gone through all of the sections, I'm kind of just... I kind of fluffed my hair out just to see where everything is at. I'm just going back in and trimming where I see that it needs to be trimmed. Um, any other like dead ends that look like they need to just be gone. I'm getting rid of them and just shaping my hair up the way that I want it to be. Um, like I said, I did go back into each section and just cut off a little bit after this. Um, so right now, this is just the very first cut that you've seen. Um, again, just going back in and cutting what needs to be cut off. Um, it already feels so much better. So if you haven't trimmed your hair in a while, this is your sign to get it together and get yourself a trim. Um, for me personally, I just always thought that trimming your hair at home by yourself is fine. You don't need to go to... A special expensive curly hair salon to get a trim you can definitely you know do it on your own so my hair feels healthy already i want to show you guys my after after i did my wash day and styled it i actually did a whole twist out and it just you guys it just feels so much better like i don't know why i waited so long i think it's just because my hair was so damaged from the color and the heat that the only thing that I had left to hold on to was the length. And please don't do that. Just just trim your hair. It'll grow so much faster. If, you know, you get rid of those dead ends, your hair won't break off at the ends. So I'm super happy with my results. If you guys have any questions, any video suggestions, please leave them in the comment box below. I'll make sure to put all the products that I used and everything in the in the description box. So um, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.